All right, I've got another quick tip for you guys, and it has to do with stealing the style of one thing and applying it to another without using shared styles, because when you use shared styles, you're essentially telling Sketch that you would like two objects to always look the same, uh, meaning if you change one, the other changes as well. And sometimes you would like to lift the appearance of something and stamp it onto something else, and then make changes to it to differentiate it from that first object. Uh, as an example here, I've got these flat weather icons, which you guys can download from LearnSketch.com. It's a freebie. And I'm going to double click in here and select this circle that has the blue gradient in it. And I'm going to do this shortcut now to copy the style of it. And it's Option, Command, C for copy. So it's like Command, C for copy, but you add the Option key in there. And now I can come up here and I can select flat weather icons, the text, and I can do Option, Command, V. For paste so it's just like paste but you add the option key in there as well and when you do that these styles are not linked together I've simply copied or duplicated the style so that I have a starting point now without having to go and redo the gradient without having to redo the shadow uh, or whatever other effects are on there so it's just kind of a big time saver and you can see if I do make a change on here if I decide to change the color altogether uh, it is not affecting that circle the way it would if I had used a shared style. And for those of you who aren't familiar with shared styles, I do have a tutorial on that. Perhaps I'll put a link in the annotations. Yep, there it is. Go ahead and click on that link in the annotations if you guys want to learn more about shared styles because it's similar to this, but it allows your objects to always match one another. So if you change one, the other changes as well. So if you guys like this tutorial, please head over to LearnSketch.com, download the freebies, and please subscribe if you haven't already. I will have more cool stuff coming soon.